Star and welcome to my channel, Starlight Starlight Soundy. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new, welcome, come on in. Uh, tonight, I've got a new company that um, I haven't ordered from before. It's called Fan Sales. That's F A N S E L O S. <laughs> but yes, Fan Sales. Um, they are a budget friendly company. Um, they have a lot of diamond paintings as well as cross stitching patterns on their website. I have seen other people review their products. This, these paintings here, um, my husband bought uh, out of his own money. And uh, there's a couple that I picked out, and then there's a couple that he picked out. Because, like, I only had, like, picked three out, I think. And then, yeah, he picked out the rest. So, so yeah, so we'll see what he got me. Um, but, like I said, it is, um, it is a budget-friendly company. And the prices are reasonable. Very, uh, I would say almost the same prices. Uh, maybe just a tad more expensive than Timu's, but not much. And if you purchase by $30 or more, add this product to card as a free gift. But I don't know what the product is because it does not say what the product is. That's, uh, so this is the, this is the, uh, website for them. And so I'm not sure, but it does say diamond painting and it does say cross stitch there. And it looks like they do customs as well some diamond paintings so it just says seasonal sale at a free gift to cart when order over uh, 30 pounds so I think US is will be if you are from the US um, like me uh, it would be a little bit more than $30 because I think pounds is higher right now than the US dollar so you'd have to hopefully they would figure that all up at the end when you're checking out but but yeah, so they have a whole bunch of different paintings. They also have a B. They also have um, diamond uh, craft. Um, what do you call it? The arts, like the, not the paintings, but the the arts. So I did notice that, like for example, here's a sun catcher here with a little hummingbird inside. Really pretty. Oh, well, that's gorgeous. I like that. So yeah, so. So yeah, they have a whole bunch of different products. So if you like diamond painting and if you like doing the diamond painting arts or if you like cross stitching, this would be a good site for you to come and look at. At least I think so. They have a lot of uh, different, they have a lot of the same, how should I say this? They have some of the same diamond paintings as Timu does, but then they also have different ones. So. So yeah, like a lot of these diamond paintings I have seen on Timu, uh, but they have different sizes than uh, some of the, these sizes are different than Timu sizes. So, so anyway, that's uh, fan sales. So again, don't guarantee, I'm not guaranteeing on the, on the shipping. Uh, let me just see if my husband did a printout here. No, he didn't put down if there was any shipping or not. So, or how much shipping was. Alrighty, so the first guy I have here is Eeyore. It's a 30 by 40. And um, he's adorable. This one is a square. And so on this color chart, you can see the color chart here. It has the code. So there is um, symbols, letters, and numbers all mixed in here. Um, the drill fill is kind of, I mean, not, not too, too bad, but you'll definitely need a light board, or at least for me, I will need a light board <laughs> to do this painting. Um, but it has the DMC numbers on it, and then it has a quanti quality, quantity of uh, drills that comes in each number, so... Uh, this is the kit that came with it. So you get a pen, you get a pair of tweezers, you get lots of wax, you get two multi-placers, and then you just get a little tray, which I'll never use anyway. But I find these trays to be very uh, flimsy. But 
But yeah, I, maybe if I'm just doing like a small amount of uh, diamonds, I might just use the little trays. But in general, I'm just using my big tray. And then these are the diamonds that came with it. Uh, now, this is, of course, is not a 230 by 40. There's no way uh, that this one is. Let me just get that in there. Uh, I can just tell by looking at it. So, got my little trusty measuring tape. So, this one is about 34. Yeah, 34. And this one is 24. So, yeah, huge borders. But definitely, definitely not a 30 by 40 or even close to what uh, a 30 by 40 in uh, other paintings that I've seen. So, it is uh, quite a bit smaller than what it appears. But anyway, I think I think ear will turn out really nice in this. It does have a couple, I think, birds in it uh, and stuff. Like, up here is the birds. And you probably can see better in the camera than what I can see on this canvas because it is a little bit um, distorted. Now, question is, it is nice and sticky, but, and it comes on a very thin canvas too, but I can, like, I don't know, maybe. I always question about this uh, if it's, uh, double-sided or if it is and I think this one is double-sided I don't think it's poured but I don't have an exacto knife here at this moment but maybe it's poured I don't know but anyway regardless very very like I said very thin canvas which I don't like very very flimsy it can hold it doesn't really hold up and then like look you could just yeah, it's not uh, the best kind of canvas, but I love the Eeyore. So, what I might do if with this guy here is because I already have it on canvas, what I might do is put him over and do a custom of him on a different site. Uh, just because, like I said, I'm not really happy with how this canvas is. I mean, I can keep the drills and everything. Um, Let's take a look at these gels and just see what they look like for... This is, like I said, the first time that I have ordered from fan sales, so... Just curious to see. I mean, they look okay at first glance, but... Oh, these ones come wrapped differently, too. How do you get in this one? Oh, way up here. Wow. Okay. All right. Nice big bag anyway. So, yeah, I mean, the drills don't look too bad. They are... They're on the smaller side. Let me just... Uh... Beautiful colors, though. I absolutely love the colors. some out and just take a look at this come on one wants to that one wants to dance around hopefully you can see all this maybe I should move it closer so these are the drills here I mean they do have a really nice shine to them and they fit nice together so they might be okay so yeah It might just be okay. Like I said, I'm just not happy with how this canvas is. I did, but that's my preference. I just don't like the thin canvases. But I don't think there's any ABs in here. So, at least I don't think so. But you got the pretty blues, you got your pinks, you got some grays there, you got your beige, pretty purple. Uh, another kind of a darker gray and like a lime green and kind of like a fuchsia pink color there another color pink 
I got a little bit of orange. Not very much orange in there. There's the blues. Some more purples. And then these are the blues. So yeah, I mean, overall the drills all look pretty nice. They don't even have that bad of an indent in them. I don't like these bags either. They're very thin bags. They can rip very easily. So I'll transfer them into stronger bags. But oh, there's a little straggler here. Or what they call a hit shaker. But yeah. Like I said, the overall they look really, really nice. But here yeah, I don't see any ABs in this one. Pinks. Pinks. The blues. No. Nope. Yep. So that's Eeyore's colors. Really, really nice. And it says, funny how big of a bag they come in. <laughs> but it'll be good for wrapping these up. Um, so these ones do come with uh, DW335, which does match the number up here, which I always look for when, because I do start, I do store my drills differently than uh, where I store my paintings. So yeah, so that's Eeyore. But so yeah, we shall see how he turns out if I even try it on this thin canvas. Like I said, I might try it on, I might just take the image and put it on a different canvas that I like. All right, and this one is a 30 by 40 and it was $3.75. Like I said, very um, comparable prices to Timu. If you do shop at Timu, where I do most of my shopping for my diamond paintings is on Timu. So, and this here is a nice thicker canvas. Canvases look really, really nice. Again, their drills are nicely in, all packaged up here, which is, or all kitted up, which is nice. And then it gets comes with your basic tray. Aww. And here's Pooh, Tigger, and Eeyore. I'm going to have so many Eeyore uh, diamond paintings. <laughs> That's okay. I don't mind. I am definitely not complaining. I'll take them all. And, uh... I'll fill up a whole book of just ear diamond paintings, no problem. This is a nice shiny canvas. I am very happy with this canvas. Very pleased with this one. And uh, really, really cute. Uh, this one is a very nice clear drill fill. As you can see, very, very nice. And it's sparkly. Uh, so, so of course, I mean, it's just these little guys, basically. And you got some greenery in the background. And then you got a couple butterflies up here. And, yeah, I think this one will turn out really nice. This one has 25 colors. And it is labeled 1 through 8 and A through X. So, that's nice. Tita approved. And... The, these ones are round and the drills look really nice in this one. Now there is no number to match that up there. So let me just write that down here. And I'll put it on a sticker after. And I'll just put 30 by 40. Alrighty, and then these are the colors here. Absolutely, really, really nice colors. Yep, 
Look at that green, how vibrant that green looks. Absolutely gorgeous. And then the uh, the oranges, which is going to be probably Winnie the Pooh and Tigger. As, and here's, an, here's a yellow here that will also be for Winnie the Pooh. So yeah, really, really nice colors. Yeah, I really like this one. Very nice. No complaints in this one at all. Alright, so this one is a 40 by 30 and it looks like it's going to be the same as uh, the first one. So, Dan probably won't be too happy with it. But we will see. Sorry about the cat. Yes, that is Blizzard talking. <laughs> okay, so this one does look a little bit better. Oh, this one does have a bees in it. And then this one comes with his tweezers too, with your pen and squishy, uh, two cover minders, and, or cover minders, sorry, two <laughs> placements, and your uh, wax. So yeah, I wish it had come with two. So no, this is the same kind of. Ah, uh, so sad. This is the same kind of uh, material, very thin canvas. And I'm not sure if you can see it, but it is a seahorse. And it is behind like a stained glass. I just thought it was really, really pretty. I've always liked seahorses. So we will see. But again, this one is a square. So maybe their squares come with thin... Uh, canvases I don't know um, but, and big borders like these borders are huge I was watching uh, DP creepy cutie <laughs> my little cutie girl over there and uh, she says oh I'm getting so much better at uh, straightening the uh, film on her canvases and I'm like yep I hear you girl because I think I'm getting pretty good at it too <laughs> but anyway if you don't know who she is yeah go check her out she does uh, pretty she shows pretty neat canvases on her um, channel some of them are pretty creepy uh, at least I don't think I could do them up. She showed one today that her eyes are just like red, red, and it's like, ooh, that would scare me. <laughs> so she, she's the creepy cutie. I'm the uh, cutie cutie. So I like the cute paintings. <laughs> uh, but uh, you, but yeah, go check her out. She's uh, pretty awesome. So anyway, here's the seahorse. <coughs> Excuse me, and. Then again, if this is in the stained glass. Um, this one does look like it has some uh, training circles on the canvas. You can see that. They are round, but yet this is a square painting. So, or at least they, it looks it looks square to me. Let me see. Oh no, sorry. This is one. This one is a round. My apologies, but it does have some ABs in it. But it looks like they're darker ABs. So let's take a look at them. Again, I'm not too crazy about this canvas. But uh, this one has 35 colors in it. Let's see, where is it? And it's got one, two, oh my goodness, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, okay guys, I am so confused. I've Has anyone else ever got a painting with ten ABs in it? What the heck? 
Okay, well, it has 10 ABs, so if you like ABs, this would be a painting for you. So, it's got like a brown color there. And it's got a bit of green there. And then pretty purple. I love the purple one. And then a bluish one, which is really nice. And then a gray. I've never seen gray, but this one's a gray. A blue. Different color blue. And here's another kind of looking gray one. And then you got a couple white. These ones look... Hmm. These ones look almost like pearl diamonds. Hey, look at these ones. Let me see. Hold on. Okay, guys. If any of you have come across paintings like this, let me know. Like I said, this is the first time that I've actually had a painting with so many ABs in it like this. Interesting. Very interesting. So this one is Snow White for their... Uh, that's what they're called for the drills, or for the color, but it's 33865, which I believe is Snow White. But, okay, so some of these have coating on them. There's a thing here. So if you can see that, and then, so this one, like, for example, I have coating. But then there's some here that don't have coating. So I don't know if that's just like a junky one. There's actually two, or three, three in here that don't have any coating. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, or even more, there's another one there. So I'm not sure. But you get very few of them anyway, so I guess they would just be splattered in here. I presume probably in the window part here. Where it's more white. Or that's actually his belly. So yeah. So probably where his belly is. So. And then there's this brown one here. And then there's. A blue one. Bluish color. Purplish blue color. So yeah. That's a lot of ABs guys. For one little painting. Especially a 30 by 40. And uh. Yeah, tons of ABs. So maybe this would be one sparkly canvas. Maybe they do that for the stained glass. Maybe the stained glass look. But again, I'm not sure if you saw that, but that's the picture there. So really, really nice. And then again, that's the drill fill. I think I showed you the drill fill already. And then probably nice and sticky. Yeah, nice and sticky. No problem with the stick. So we shall see on this one. I love the colors. I, all the blues and stuff in it. It looks absolutely gorgeous. And then of course it's got the pinks and the purples and stuff. So. And I got this all stuck. There we go. Um, let's see if there's the number on here. Yeah, so here's the number here. Right here that corresponds with the painting. So yeah, so there's that one. And this one was uh, $6.29. Okay, so one out of two ain't bad. Not to say that I don't like the other ones, it's just I don't care for that canvas so uh, this one's a 30 by 40 and let's see him let's see what it is oh well if he comes out let's see <laughs> oh dear they I don't know how they show them in these bags sometimes 
and I struggled to get them out. There we go. Yay, we did it. All right. So canvas looks good. Oh, no, sorry. This one's a 30 by 30. He's just a little, well, a little bit bigger than a pint size, but oh my gosh, he is adorable. Love some flowers and the cutest donkey ever. Yes, I like my donkeys. <laughs> and where's my straightener gone to? Here it is. Just really, really cute. Uh, this one has 16 colors. So this one will be, uh, will take probably very long to do. It does, oh dear. It does look like there's a lot of uh, color blocking in it, which is nice. Let me tell you, I definitely need a break from, <laughs> from all the confetti I've been working on today. I'm doing kind of the middle part of my, uh, my canvas, uh, or my diamond painting. And my little fairy girl, her butterfly fairy girl. And, uh. Yeah, I was working on the middle part, and I'm like, oh, just get me to the block. Just want to uh, color block for a while. But I like to go in sections when I diamond paint. And so I think that's just part of uh, my OCD. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Anyway, so there he is. Just really, really cute. He's going to, he still needs to be fixed. I don't know. He didn't like to get straightened, I guess. I don't know why some of these don't like to get straightened right away. But I'm going to try this again. There we go. So really, really cute. Really nice uh, drill fill there. I think the sunflowers are going to turn out absolutely beautiful. And again, the donkey is so, so cute. He's smiling. Aw. So cute. I love this one. Um... And then you just get the basic kit here. Oh, a nice dark green boat. And these are the diamonds. So they does does have 15, or sorry, six, 16 colors. And it is labeled 1 through 8, or sorry, 1 through 9 and 8 to G. And so, yeah, really nice colors in there. Very nice. Definitely a keeper. Okay, so we got two out of two, guys. And that's... Oh, we got pretty sticky. Not as sticky as some, but not too bad either. So, I like this one. Let's go to this one. Uh, this one was... How much is this one? Let's see. If I have this one on the list that he gave me. Hmm. I don't see this one on the list. So, I don't know if this was an extra one. Or maybe it came from somewhere else. Maybe I'll just save that one. <laughs> they don't see it on the list. I might have gotten into this bag by accident. So this one here was $3.77. Again, I don't know how to get these into the bag. Ooh, sorry. Squeaky, squeaky. All right. Ooh, this one is a dirty canvas. I think someone was drinking coffee and spilt on it. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. I know I have some shadows here, but right here, it's dirty. Weird. But oh well, good thing it's not on the front. But yeah, it's just poo. Very colorful poo. Mr. Pooh Bear. I love the colors. It's got pinks and greens and purples and every color of the rainbow. And this one is very sticky. Oh my. Very sticky canvas. Wow. That's one good stick, let me tell ya. Nice and sticky. <laughs> you 
He's saying, nope, not today. He's got his arms crossed. <laughs> Either that or he's just chilling, maybe. <laughs> he is happy. He's got a really, really pretty smile. Or a cute smile. So he is a happy bear. But yeah, I just really like the colors on this one. Very, very colorful. There's a little... A picture of him there. So, just really nice. Uh, drill fill looks really nice. This one does have symbols. This one is all, almost all symbols. Ugh. A lot of symbols. And then it does have some letters and it has some small letters. So, yeah. But that's okay. Uh, there's his nice clear drill fill there. If you can see that. His little nose. So yeah, I think I think everything's gonna turn out really nice on him. I think you'll have no problem seeing his nose or his eyes or his little um, eyebrows and his smile there should turn out. So, just really, really cute. And again, I think we know how sticky this one is. Yeah, really sticky. <laughs> and again, just a simple kit. And this one has uh, this number here. It does correspond with the numbers on the bags. So each bag actually has a number in this one, so which is nice. But here's the drills here. Really pretty colors in there. I love the colors. Very nice indeed. So yeah, again he is 23 colors on this on this canvas so and there's the poof so so cute i will find out where this one came from like i said this one isn't on the list i mean we could take a look look at it but i would kind of want to know where it comes from first before i take a look at it. it does have a pretty butterfly and sunflower so i'm definitely gonna like that one it's probably one that my husband picked out and yeah but anyway, guys, that's it for tonight. Thank you so much for joining me. I so appreciate it. Um, like I said, I'm happy with this one. We'll just kind of review them again. I'm really happy with this one. I think this one will turn out really, really nice too. So that is the... Uh, really happy with that one and this one. So these are my three choices for tonight. I think this one is just really cute. My favorite would have to probably be this one here. I really uh, like it. This one might even go up on my wall pretty soon. We will see. Okay, I was I don't know who I was talking to, but I was saying I need more. I need more time in the day, and I need more arms and hands so I can get all these diamond paintings done. <laughs> So, and then this one here, I was not too crazy about, but I do love the image. So, like I said, I might go and get this put on a different canvas, and I'll be very happy with that. But yeah, I mean, I might try him and just see. I mean, I love the birds in this one too, and like I just yeah, I really like the image to this uh, painting. I just don't like the canvas. And the same with this one here. I'm not crazy about the canvas. And all the ABs, I like I said, if please please let me know if you've ever had a painting with so many that came with so many ABs. But and then this was the other one. So so yeah. Um I will try to put uh, the list down in my description of uh, the prices of this one. But uh, we will, 
I do have it in a printout, but that's not gonna help help you. So, oh, and then my husband also accidentally he said he got a cross stitch. So if you are into cross stitching, then um, I think I'll put it in one of my giveaways. But I can quickly show you. But uh, I used to cross stitch all the time, but I don't anymore. Um, but yeah, so it's just a cute donkey and a kitty there in a winter scene. Uh, this one should come with everything. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to probably put this in a give in my giveaway box. Uh, so, if you, or if you like cross-stitching. This one is, looks like a pretty good size one. It is a 40 by 50. And it does come with all your colors here, which is, they look really nice. They feel really nice. So... Really nice colors there for this cross stitch. Very, very nice. If I can fold that back up again. Love the colors. It does come with a lit with two needles here. Your needles. This is a nice thick canvas actually, which is really nice. And then here's your grid here. And, and then here's your uh, pattern right here for it. So, so yeah. Uh, I'm not sure. So I don't know how, when I used a cross stitch, I cross stitched, um, I didn't have the pattern. I, I freestyled it or whatever you want to call it. I can't remember the correct term for it. It's been many years. It was when my children were small and my oldest is 33 now so <laughs> many many years ago. But um, but yeah like like I've never seen these like what are these bumps here? Are these like done already maybe? You don't have to do those? I'm not sure. Hmm. Like I said, I haven't cross stitched for so long, so I don't know how how that even works. But anyway, so you do have it's got 25 colors, and it does have all the DMC colors here, and then it has the symbols that you follow here. But yeah, I'm not sure what these ones here. I mean, they look finished, so maybe you don't do this. Maybe maybe that just comes with it. Other than that, there's no instructions on how to cross stitch. Most most of these come with instructions. Well, they used to come with cons with instructions, but I guess they don't. This one, at least this one, does not come with any instructions. So, if you don't know how to how to cross stitch, then I would probably not get this one because it doesn't tell you unless you watch videos. But yeah, it's funny that yeah, this one doesn't come with it. Oh well. So, like I said, this one will probably go in a giveaway. Uh, I'll do like just a little giveaway of this cross stitch. So whoever does cross stitch and is interested in it. I mean, it is adorable picture there. There he is there, just with the horsey and the little kitty. And it's a winter scene, so and do it now and have it ready for the winter or start it in the fall. And again, this was a 40 by 50. So he says he thought it was a diamond painting, so he sometimes gets on these sites and just goes, you know, clicks, 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 click, 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 click. <laughs> but yeah. So let's just put this back in here. I have my hands full with diamond painting. I don't think I would take the time to even start a, a cross stitching one. Just I'd have to actually get into cross stitching again, and I, like I said, I've I've never done a pattern before, so uh, or one that's already patterned out. I've always just gotten cross stitching. That uh, my mother was a good teacher for me for cross stitching. She cross stitched, and that's who taught me how to cross stitch. She also knitted, and I learned how to knit. I learned how to crochet on my own. I don't think she ever crocheted. 
Um, she also did plastic canvas. Does anyone remember plastic canvas? And is that still a thing? Can I mean, she made so many Kleenex boxes. <laughs> Our house was full of them. Full of uh, Kleenex boxes, but yeah. But anyway, guys, all right, that's it now. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, I, I so appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, until next time, God's richest blessings. See ya.